uh, what we're doing today is um, it's a sort of play with words. It's a moussaka but with potatoes and minced lamb and uh, mozzarella cheese. Also there's some um, exotic mushroom in there. We started by frying um, onion, garlic and then the minced lamb or minced beef, whatever you prefer. And then we add all the spices. There's mixed herbs in there, there's cumin, there's, uh, coriander, fresh coriander, there's powdered coriander. Uh, we have oregano in there. And then you fry them. Once you fry them, if the onion is soft, you fry the, uh, the mince. And then you wait until it's all have that nice golden brown color. And you add um, some grated carrot. The reason being is uh, sometimes when you have the mince, there's uh, that bitterness and also there's that strong um, taste of the mince. So you, you break that by the grating some carrot to give it a bit of sweetness. Um, the potatoes, I slice them and uh, just give them two minutes, launch them in hot water and then we just may make a layer of potatoes in here and lay it on the side. Once the minced beef or lamb is cooked, so you first layer of potatoes, then you have mozzarella cheese. I prefer mozzarella, the reason why if you put cheddar, you can use cheddar but it's add a little bit of the sauce become greasy once you get it out of the oven. So that's why I prefer mozzarella. First layer, then we put the mince. Here. Now, for people who don't like normal potatoes, you can change potatoes with sweet potatoes. You can change it with aubergine, peppers, any or courgette, any vegetable you prefer. So that's the second layer of the mince. Put it evenly. And then we add again slices of cheese. For the taste, some people like it spicy, some people like it. If you like it spicy, you obviously add some um, chili or harissa or Tabasco sauce or whatever sauce you want to make it hotter. But today is a mild one. I've got some mild spice lovers today, so that's the other layer of And we just get some grated cheese, which is uh, better on the topping because that just bake nicely and that gives that nice golden sticky texture. There we go. And ready. Oven is already been preheated on 200 uh, electric 200 and it's ready to cook. Wonderful. And it's ready. Yeah. About 45 minutes. 